coming to you live from an undisclosed location. Or maybe not so undisclosed. It's somewhere in Virginia. Happy Friday, everybody! I'm riding, 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 riding in my RV, my RV, wherever I want to be. Because I'm free in my RV. Well, what do you know? It says excellent connection here on my on my studio. So maybe 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 uh, you know uh, our our internet woes are over. You know, have uh, actually t t today I'm transmitting with um, uh, Verizon visible through visible, and uh, we'll see we'll see how it goes. Uh, it's it's the better of the three. So <laughs> and um, thank you everybody for hanging out and. Uh, uh, this traveler, yes, very uh, observant, Mr. This traveler. We are in the mountains. That's the view out uh, my window here, and uh, it's a beautiful uh, RV resort, um, part of the the Sun Outdoors deal. And uh, you know, every other month or so, you know, I'm gonna be staying at one of these and and reviewing them, and uh, most of them are are very nice. Let me tell you. By the way, check out, I mean, the lighting is bad, but this is the new Pelicamp uh, uh, t-shirt with the new uh, updated logo, which I'm, I'm thinking this is going to be like my official logo from now on. I really like that Pelican. As you noticed, I changed this, the, the, the Pelican for you guys, for your guys, the, the members. And now it's the same Pelican. It's just gray, so it looks good, uh, either on a white background or a black background. That's, that's how I did it in that color. So I'm glad it looks and sounds great on your end. Uh, up until last minute, I was kind of worried because it's been bad. I mean, I, right now I have the, the, the booster and it, I, it, I think it's going to work. Uh, Ronald Son Gomez, a happy Friday. The RV DJ, hello there, Jane Tones, Mr. This Traveler. Looks like you're in New Mexico or perhaps Canada. No, this is Appalachia, brother. Appalachia, uh, Lee Green, hi there. Vagando everywhere por todos lados. No Starlink yet. Hey, it's coming. They 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 charge my credit card. They, they just haven't shipped yet. <laughs> but I'm gonna have Starlink uh, probably for the Lewis and Clark trip. Uh, you know, I have to figure out how to do that roaming, activate that roaming system and all that. But should be good. What an awesome view. Yes, it is. It is a beautiful area. And uh, today I did a couple of hikes at. Uh, Okay, I'll, I'll say it. we're at Natural Bridge, Virginia. Uh, I did a couple of hikes there in Natural Bridge, beautiful area. And yesterday we did we did a drive on the Blue Ridge Parkway. And tomorrow we're going to Monticello. So that's the plan for for this weekend before we start heading back south with it, you know, rather quickly, you know, two or three hundred miles per day. Uh, we're gonna head back south. Hey, Dylan Reynolds in the house. Uh, New England base assassin super chat yes uh, hey Robert just started making travel videos super excited uh, congratulations on Bob's videos that's all this is so cool it is my first time but I watched 100 of your videos at least hey thank you thank you for watching um, I bet you're close to my location maybe Jim more happy April Fool's Day yes the no April Fool's joke, no, no joke, no joke. This is really where we are. No, no green screen. There's not a whole lot of movement right now. The, it's it's still the the, the low season. Oh, my neighbor has a problem with his with his water heater. It's, uh, you can't see it on the on the image there, but it's, it's leaking. Maybe he's the winterizing for all we know. Um, good afternoon for, from Atlantic Beach. Uh, North Carolina Outer Banks love the Outer Banks. Only 388 days until retirement. There, you're counting them, huh? Well, early congrats to you. Greetings from Chihuahua, Mexico. Hola, Victor Hugo Contreras Mora. Uh, all right, let me reset the chat here. This is like really going faster than expected. Oh, there you go, Christopher Olsen. Yeah, new Pelican, Pelican, Pelican. Yeah, it doesn't show the pelican here when I do the. <laughs> but uh, yeah, the other one was too generic, and since the, you know um, this person called Carrie, Carrie, 
um, designed this one for for me specifically. So I'm like, you know, I'm gonna make it my official the official Pelican logo, and it's kind of funny. It's a funny Pelican. Maybe I can uh, eventually. I want to do also like a more cartoonish version of my free my RV, like my truck toy, my trailer. So if I change trucks or if I change trailers, it's you know I don't have to change the logo every time. So uh, West Virginia, not too far from me. No, and we're not far from West Virginia. And um, I was thinking about it. I was even singing the the John Denver song on the way here, but uh, uh oh. It says YouTube that we may experience buffering. So uh, if you're experiencing buffering, uh, let me know. Colin McSherrill, have you ever visited anywhere in Asia? Would you like to, would you want to visit Japan? I've never been in Asia. In, and probably Japan is going to be my first Asian country, if not uh, Turkey. One of the two, which is the ends of Turkey, right? What IPA are you we drinking today? Well, I'm glad you asked because I have forgotten about it. And this I got a, a couple of days ago from our friend Jim in D.C. And this is a, 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 from Atlantis Brewing a Company. Brewing Works as a Ponzi IPA. And we actually went to the brewery. We had lunch there. We had some pizza and some IPO. That was loud. And uh, they're right by the Washington Nationals Park. So cheers, everybody. Happy Friday. And lately I've been losing my voice. I don't know what's going on with that. By the way, we're gonna we're gonna witness a beautiful afternoon out there, a beautiful sunset uh, on those mountains there, and uh, I just I just love I just love uh, seeing it, you know. Oh, he says here uh, the streams bit rate, 1.5 kilobits per second is lower than the recommended. I'm happy to get 1.5. This is you know we are here, like. And that's with the with the with the. By the way, did you like the, the video about the booster? And I know it, it's an expensive device, but the only reason we are able to do this live stream today is because of that booster. Otherwise, until we get, uh, I mean, if I had like a, a killer Verizon plan on my Weingart antenna, that would be even better. But uh, since I don't have an unlimited Verizon plan on that antenna, that a truly unlimited Verizon plan, that's the only thing that is kind of working well here. Uh, and we have campground Wi-Fi, which is actually better than average, but not enough for, for, for the live stream. Uh, Robert, have you heard of a Grand Canyon of Pennsylvania? Uh, no, I have not. I have heard of many Grand Canyons, but not the one in Pennsylvania. Darren Traveling Robert, you should have said you were somewhere and did an April Fool's joke, joke going on the entire chat. Hey, for all we know, this could be a green screen or a, or a picture. I mean, there's really not a whole lot, lot of movement there, so it could be a picture, right? And uh, and then you'll find out I'm in Finland, no, not with many anyone. Never mind. I'm 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 not good at telling uh, <laughs> at doing April Fool's jokes. Amaranto Cabrera, happy Friday, Robert, and best wishes to you in your travels. I can't even read today. <laughs> to you and your mom, Miss Ely. Yes, Ili, I miss Ili too, man. And uh, mom is here. Mom is here. Actually, she did like a tenth of a mile hike today with me. So, um, yeah. Hey, Jim in D.C. Happy Friday, brother. Cheers. Cheers with some D.C. beer. By the way, thank you. Thank you for for hanging out with us on, on, on Monday and, and enduring the, the the frigid temperatures with the, with the wind chilled, with the wind chill. And, uh, and all that, and uh, it's pretty cool because that that parking space that where we parked uh, on Monday, I decided to park there again on Tuesday. So, so we actually went uh, about halfway around uh, uh, a tidal basin there. It's very cool. Let me know if we're buffering. Good morning, Robert from fellow travelers Glenn and Teresa Dodd from New Zealand. New Zealand, uh, one of these days, one of these days we'll make it to New Zealand. By the way, the furnace just kicked on and we're getting nice. It's it's kind of chilly out there today. And um, actually, these people gave, gave me a complimentary golf cart, and we, my mom and I, mom and I were were zipping around on the, on the golf cart earlier when we got back from the hike. And uh, and yeah, it was uh, uncomfortably cold. Yeah, I, this guy. I don't know if I should do it. Is, uh, I don't know why this thing isn't updating. 
you know, I think that this outside camera, yeah, it is working. It's just, it's not like full motion. I don't know why. But yeah, this guy's uh, uh, heater is, uh, water heater is leaking. Yeah, I wonder why this camera is not full motion. There's, there's something wrong with the USB. Sometimes that happens. Uh, anyway, I'm glad this one is working well. Maybe if I change it to a different USB port, you think that... I mean, that the, the outside camera is not as important as, as the inside camera, but I still want to give you a, like an outside view. Let's see. This might work better. Let me move it. Just Yeah, yeah. Now now we're getting a, a true live shot here from, uh, from the mountains of Virginia. Maybe if I tilt up a little more, we'll get a little more, a, a less saturated view. There we go. Yeah, that'll work. All right, I'm going to reset the chat here. And I'm going to go backwards from uh, Murad uh, Bro. Hello, Mr. Robert, you are the best all the time. We, uh, we hello by Canada, Montreal. Good vibes. And uh, that's a super cool vintage RV out there. Yes, it is. It is, it is a cool RV. They just arrived. I mean, this campground has been nearly, that's a travel craft. That's an older class uh, C there. Um, <clears throat> that place looks like good hiking trails. Well, we, we, we did some hiking trails in the in the Natural Bridge area. And of course, we're right next to the Blue Ridge. The Blue Ridge Parkway is, it's a, like a 20 minute drive. And uh, we just did a good segment of the, of the Johnny Kite Bartolo. Hello everybody, happy Friday. Natalie Driscoll, not buffering here. Good to know. Good to know. Now it says that it went up to 1.8. I mean, it, it, at some point, if the if, if the, one, the one problem with my visible plan horizon is if if, is if, at, if at one point the the tower were to get um, uh, you know overwhelmed, was uh, congested, I may suffer from some deprioritization. You know, where they slow me down temporarily. Uh, Jim and DC, Robert, we had fun. We still. Uh, a few flowers hanging on, but you arrived at a great time other than the freaking cold wind. I know, man. <clears throat> I mean, we had been to cold places. And the last week in D.C. Was, uh, was top three of the coldest places I've ever been. Top one, of course, would have been the Arctic Ocean in Alaska. And uh, I'm trying to think of a top two, but... Uh, yeah, today, hey, everybody say hello to my mom who's here in front of me. Um, hey, hi, everyone. Greetings from Blue Ridge Mountains. Love. Hey, there you go. Uh, greetings from Pleasant Hill, California. Hey, Neon Pony. You got to see the cherry blossoms. I got that, that, that picture for your mom. We got a picture, actually, a similar picture. We got, a, I think it's on her phone. We got a... a uh, a similar picture to the one in 1958, but not quite the same. No, no, that's not the same tree. We, we would have had to walk another quarter mile, and we were like pressed for time and tired. So, but similar tree, similar view, it's good enough. Good evening, Robert. What is the temperature where you are? It's along 35 degrees here in Minnesota. It's in the 50s, but it's windy. So with with the wind chill, it probably feels like 40. A beautiful time of the year for visiting Virginia. Yes, it is. It, I mean, it, yesterday was a rainy day, uh, like most of the day. But then, at, at like at three p.m., the sun the sun came out on and off, and I'm like, let's go to the Blue Ridge Parkway. Let's let's uh, see some some mountains, and we got to see some beautiful views. So yeah, and I did that section of the Blue Ridge uh, Parkway back in I want to say 2019, after Hershey RV show. I came down through through the Blue Ridge, but it was cloudy. So today, it's uh, it's beautiful. Is that a state or county RV park? This is actually a private RV park. This is part of this. It's a Jellystone. It's part of the Sun Outdoors um, network. Let's, let's call it a network. And uh, yeah, this camera is still. Uh, I guess since it's both cameras are on the same USB hub, that might be the issue. But I don't have any other USB to connect it to right now. So. It is what it is. I want to see the map behind you. 
updated next live stream. Yeah, I know. I know. I need to add. You know, I'm adding in with the videos that I'm doing. And uh, as, as far as YouTube is concerned, we haven't been in this particular RV. We haven't been to Alabama or, or, or Mississippi or Louisiana or Tennessee for that matter. So those four are going to be updated uh, very soon here. Hey, Mr. CLT. When is the next Mini Tini Lounge? Uh, I don't know. Because uh, I'm going to be back and forth. I'm, I'm in the process of, process of restoring Mini Tini 1. Uh, wait, if Casino RV Life is giving me a great uh, hand with that. He's been a great, great friend. Hey, Casino RV Life, here, here, there he is. And, uh, you know, he's holding down the fort there in, in North Florida, you know, you know, taking care of Mini Tini 1. And um, by the time it, 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 we, we're done with Mini Tini 1, it is, it is going to be almost like brand new. I just have to fix a couple of things inside and the cosmetic things and it's going to be great. Let me show you real quick here. And this is more or less the shot, the shot of, uh, we should do a comparison, do like the 1958 shot and the 2022 shot. 60, 64 years in between. But yeah, this is the, the picture. And here's mom. Say hello to my mom. Hi. Hi, everybody. Love you. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, we, we were able to take that picture. And uh, by the way, this place is great. The only thing besides the bad internet, there's, there's like very little in terms of like supermarkets and stuff like like uh, to be able to, 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 to get food, we would have to drive half an hour or so. So, yeah. Nicolás Perretti. Hi, Robert. Espero verte pronto por mi país, Argentina. Y que recorras la Patagonia. Definitely para la Patagonia. I want to go all the way to Ushuaia, eh, Argentina. And hopefully they get the get the cruise that goes to Antarctica. That would be like epic. Hopefully you're having fun on the trip, Robert. Looks like you're having fun. Yes, it's been a lot of fun. We've 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 done many different things, and uh, and it's been great. And someone left us. Did someone? Did I miss a super chat? I don't know what happened. So I'm sorry, girls. Trouchon. Thank you for that super chat. Hello, Robert. Have a good weekend from Quebec City. And, uh, uh, oh, here it is. There you go. Look, look at me. <clears throat> Since we haven't had any super chats today, I'm like, uh, I didn't know if, uh, oh, man, that, yeah, he's got something wrong with his uh, water heater for sure. <laughs> I'm sorry, I get easily distracted. Not sure who Jim is, but he'll be in my thoughts. Jim from DC? Oh, young Dave, a natural bridge, cool place. There used to be a scale replica of Stonehenge just down the road, made from styrofoam, called Foamhenge. <laughs> I, 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 don't, I haven't seen it, so I don't know if it's here anymore. But uh, it's very cool. We're by the, the town of uh, Glasgow, uh, Virginia. Robert, if you need assistance at the Mini Tini Lounge, let me know. Bar will be open. <laughs> Sounds good, man. Sounds good. As soon as I spend, if, I, if I'm able to spend one whole weekend in Miami, which I probably will before the, the Lewis and Clark trip, which, by the way, the Lewis and we're departing like in two or three weeks uh, because... Uh, it doesn't look like the Silverado is going to happen as quickly as I was expecting. They have they're having delays, you know, chip chip uh, shortages and whatnot. So uh, uh, old campers should be better than new after work. Oh, don't tell Winnebago, but I'm 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 gonna you know I'm gonna I'm gonna see if I can make as many upgrades as possible and have it there. You know, it's I I, I you know that's where it all started. It has a, a little bit of sentimental value. And, uh, and, uh, yeah, it's, we're getting, uh, we're, we're fixing the axles. We're getting all new brakes, new bearings, new tires, new roof, 
and uh, hopefully I can upgrade the batteries to lithium and uh, and the inverter to, to something that can power the whole thing. Jim in DC, love you, Alma Morales. Paula says hi. It was awesome seeing your mom in the live stream last Sunday. Bob's videos, I hope you come to Indiana Dunes National Park. I saw your Indiana Dunes State Park show and it was cool. Of course, your America the Beautiful Pass will work at the National Park. I have to go to the National Park, yes. Uh, that's for sure. And vagando everywhere por todos lados. Jim is, our, is in our thoughts. His mom died, said the RV DJ. Oh, I'm so sorry. Uh, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't see that. Uh, I'm sorry, Jim. Sorry for your loss, man. And um, yeah, yeah. We we have too 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 many gems here in, in this family, right? Uh, but yeah, it's um, it's uh, Jim. It's, it's Sonia's Jim, and uh, we have Jim from Ohio, Jim from DC, and I'm sure there's uh, another Jim. Hello, Pelican Chief. Stay safe and keep traveling. Love from Pakistan. Hello, Pakistan. Great to to to, to receive a, a messages from all over the world. Uh, I miss seeing Minitini One on a trip. Yeah, Minitini One. You're gonna be seeing Minitini One. I, I hopefully soon on a trip here. Uh, Mom says, thanks for the greetings. Bob Leach, Indiana Dunes is booked out. I, I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. It's one of those places, you know, it's, I, I, I was amazed. I was gonna. I was able to get one night. I just, and that's the one thing. Some of these uh, state parks, you, you sometimes you can get just one night, but getting several nights, that's when the issue is. Right? Uh, Steven Acosta, good afternoon, Robert. Great pictures of your trip. Are you going back to the original Minitini, which is your favorite Minitini? Well, as far as comfort and space, this is it. This is it, but uh, I towed Minitini 1. Whenever I go into Minitini 1, whenever I tow Minitini 1, I kind of, you know, I, it's, uh, I kind of like it too. I, I, I can't say I have a favorite. Minitini 2 was very good too for what it was. I, I was I was sad to, to see it go but Minitini 3, that's where they kind of nailed it with the power systems and all that. So it's it's great to be able to run the AC on batteries and that. It's just, if I could get something this size without a slide, you know what I mean? The slide is kind of the one thing that uh, I like when it is out, but I hate when it is in. Does that make any sense? And Minitini 1 was the same. It was the same cramped little thing uh, the whole time, but you get used to it. And that's the thing. <clears throat> Donald Phillips, hey, thanks so much for your fantastic content. Thank you. Wandering Wagners, what are your summer trip plans? Great Lakes Midwest are highly underrated. I know, I know. And I've been to the Midwest. And I want to see many parts of the Midwest as, as, I, as, I, as I tag along the route that Lewis and Clark took uh, from 1804 through 1808, um, which is up the, up, the, up the Ohio, then the Mississippi, then the Missouri, crossing the Rockies down to Columbia. And that's going to be roughly, if you, if, you, if, if you look at that route, that's going to be roughly my route. But I'm going to make many detours, like I'm thinking of, you know, when I'm in Kentucky, you know, driving south a little bit and see the like the arc. They have the arc experience there. That that would something be something interesting to see. When I'm in South Dakota, I'm gonna make the detour to see the Black Hills and, and, and Crazy Horse and Mount Rushmore and whatnot and, and, and you know what's the name of the uh Do, Do, what's the name of them? The the Western town. It'll come to me. Susan M, thank you for that super chat. Thank you so much. <clears throat> uh, Jason, uh, any plans to tour Canada in the future? Yes, probably next year. Next year, it could happen next... Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do next summer. I, I don't know what I did last summer. Is it snowing or raining? No, it's not. Let's see what, what it looks like out there. Anywho, Susan Beard... Thank you for that super chat. You have had an amazing scenery lately. Love it. I'm glad you like it. And this is the view 
outside our window here. And we have this great view of these mountains right here. Uh, yeah, I just discovered this feature. They have, the, they have like on the left here, they have like a fishing lake. Then they have a swimming lake, a mini golf, and then there's a water park. And there's a lot more that we can't really see. There. But look at that. That mountain is beautiful this time of the day with the, with the light the way it is right now. It's very nice. Yep. What am I doing? All right, back to me. Matthew de la Cameli, what's up? Love your videos. Thank you. And Maxine Oliver says, hi, mom. Hi, Ely and Ely. Hello. Yeah, Ely is in Miami. Mom is here. And uh, we're going to be on the road for another week or so. Gabrielle S. Hey, Gabby. I'm sorry we're late. Hello from Journey Rider and I. Journey pointed to the TV and pointed and said, it's Robert. Oh, my gosh. That's that's so cute. Uh, you have to record that. Deadwood, thank you so much, Radu. I, I knew it started with a D. Uh, <clears throat> um, lost my train of thought. Anywho, uh, Jay will be in South Dakota in July. Are you planning any meetups while you are up there in the West? Maybe, and July may be the date when we uh, are, uh, go, go through South Dakota. So that, that, might, that might work out. Uh, I know I want to do a, a meetup in D.C. on the way back. I know I want to do a meetup. We should do a St. Louis meetup for sure. I mean... As long as we don't have to drink Budweiser, it's all good. I'm sure they have other breweries. <laughs> I'm kidding. I, I, I'm not a beer snob. I'm fine with a Bud Light if that's, you know. Uh, but um, I would really look forward with, uh, to a St. Louis meetup. Nothing like a good barbecue and a good IPA. And they have some really good barbecue in St. Louis. I can vouch for that. My mom says that it's hot in here. It's getting hot in here, but she's like all bundled up with a with a with, with a windbreaker and all that. Let me let me. Uh, you, you guys enjoy the outside view. I'm gonna turn up the to turn down the furnace a little bit. And here we are. Are you going to Luray Cavern to see the pipe organ made of stalagmites? No, where is that? Luray Cavern, is that around here? You know, I, I've, I came here and I've seen a couple of things, but I haven't done all the research that I should have done, if you know what I mean. You know, you got to save something for next time. And I hope I don't kill the internet. Actually, I do have a, a pin at Luray Caverns, believe it or not. And, uh, well, that's an hour and 44 minutes from here, and uh, it's northeast of here. We're going to save that for a different trip. But uh, <clears throat> I do have, a, you know, one of those, like one of those, those thousand yellow pins in my map. Uh, that is one of them. So eventually we'll go there. This is Cathedral-sized vibrant rock formations, according to Google, to the Googles. Yeah, and, and at some point, and that's kind of, in, in a sense, my idea of the Lewis and Clark trip. I'm going to try to do all the little pins I have on my map. As long as they are like within, let's call it 45, 50 miles from our, our planned route. I'm going to see if... Uh... Let me... Uh... <clears throat> How was Cherry Hill Army Park? We stayed several times. Great place. Yeah. And I noticed they have like swimming pool, hot tub, all kinds of amenities. We basically just went there to sleep. And uh, it was cold, so we couldn't take care of uh, any of those. But, but it's, it's very good. It's well maintained. Um, no complaints. No complaints, really. Love Deadwood. Yeah, we're going to visit Deadwood for sure on, this, uh, on the Lewis and Clark trip, even though it's not related at all. So, uh, <clears throat> you know, some parts of the trip are going to be a very... Um, history oriented you know we're gonna visit fort mandan even though i was already there but we'll do it again and uh, places like that but 
it's it's uh, it's basically more like a, an, an overview. You know what I mean? More than just following exactly in the footsteps of uh, of Lewis and Clark. Our best life. Thank you so much for that super chat. My voice, man. <clears throat> I've been like this for like two months already. This is ridiculous. Uh, Robert, in 2019, you were uh, the very first RV YouTuber we watched on Amazon Prime. And now we are 10 months full time with our three kids. Thank you for the inspiration. No, you're very welcome, man. I wish I could put more videos on Amazon Prime, but that, now that Amazon wants me to charge for them. And I don't know. I might do like the minimum and... You know, but I, I don't feel, it doesn't feel right charging for, I could do, I could do like the minimum for them. I'm getting a text message here sometimes. It is something I forgot. It's not Wingwood IPA, it's Pelican Head IPA. Don't forget to come by and get yours. Oh man. Yeah, but it says Wingwood Brewing, but it doesn't matter. Forget about the IPA, what's, what's that, what's that burger? I, wa I want that burger. In this place, the camera not focusing. Focus camera, focus, focus, focus. There you go. You're making me hungry, uh, and uh, and we ate well today. We I made a uh, salmon and potatoes on the grill. Uh, Jim, Jim from Ohio. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna start naming all the gyms. I think. I think, Jim. I think that's a good idea. I have a video of Journey dancing to your music. It's funny as we were in the car. She does love you. Also, no longer easy to hold growing up so fast. I know, man. It's been three, three years already since that uh, uh, first Ohio meetup, pre-pandemic first Ohio meetup. Oh man, Robert, your many road trip videos inspired us so much. Our van is almost ready. Th uh, thank you for showing us the beautiful U.S. Thank you, Agnes. And yes, it is, it, I mean, and every state has something beautiful to see. Don't be fooled by thinking like the Midwest has nothing to do. It's, yeah, this camera is it's not working. That, that That's a still shot. Let me see. I could connect it here. Hold on. Bear with me. I'm going to do something real quick. I could connect it here, but then I might lose the mouse. Which I shouldn't I shouldn't be testing these things on live television, right? I mean the the mouse shouldn't consume all that much bandwidth. Okay, I still have a mouse. Now do I have a camera? Is that camera live? Yeah, camera is live. Okay, problem solved. We just need to connect uh, cameras to different uh, buses on the computer. Um, American Made Adventures, Mogote, Colorado, got a lot of snow today, styrofoam balls, three to four inches deep in an hour, Not now sunny. Well, so when it's uh, sunny right after the snow, it's uh, it's beautiful. Hey, Robert, what's for supper? I don't know yet. We're going to figure something out. I have a pizza there that, that I've been itching to, to make, so we might make pizza. We have some leftover picadillo from yesterday. I might put on my 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 headlamp and, and grill some burgers out there we'll see twilight live cabin hi robert it is, it is our first time here my wife and i love your youtube channel thank you so much and welcome welcome to the show we're here every friday 6 p.m unless there's no internet in which case well what can you do right uh, <laughs> i knew you were gonna say that st louis barbecue they can't spell barbecue in st louis but luckily Luckily, we're going. We're going by Kansas City too, so we're gonna. Maybe we should do like a, like a like a mano a mano, you know, like a Kansas City St. Louis barbecue, uh, competition and, we, and and dueling dueling meetups. We're gonna do a meetup in Kansas City. We sh we should finally do do that meetup in Kansas City, Kevin. I think. Uh, uh, I think I think that's uh, that would be a good idea. By the way, oh, if I can find it, hold on. Bob's videos, that's all. Thank you for that super chat. Robert's the best, no fooling. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Really appreciate it. And uh, Chief Pelican Head, the message retracted. Member for eight months. I'm trying to look for the CLT one. 
because CLT has been a member for 26 months. Executive producer, beg, beg your pardon. It's weird. Mine says one month too. Let's see when I post if it changed. Yeah, 26 months. Thank you. Thank you for being a chief pelican head and executive producer, no less. Oh, man. That beer is good. And my, I, as soon as I get back to Florida, I got to get new glasses. Here we go. I finally found it. 26 months. That's over two years, man. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. And uh, someone's texting me. Again. Uh, oh, FedEx. Package picked up. Scheduled for delivery 4-7. Take control of your package, man. What did I order from FedEx? I don't know. Sagar Das, I'm new here. Well, welcome. Welcome to the show. Hey, hey Lucas here, Mr. Red Jaguar 100 Travels. Welcome to the show. I'll sh uh, sorry, I missed you as you passed through Long Island. I passed really quickly, so I was easy to miss. <laughs> Uh, any plans to get back to Arizona? We haven't been in a couple of years. Uh, we are itching to go in January. January for sure. We're going we're gonna to do Quartzite once again. And then we're going to try to do the, the Arizona we haven't done yet. And the one we have, you know, we, we might even look for a property. So uh, we'll see. Pelican Quest, anybody? Uh, uh, Putnik Oprolazu. Dear Robert, we enjoy watching your beautiful and educational shows. Great, uh, great greetings to you from Rainy Sar Sarmadevo, a beautiful city on the Danube River in eastern Serbia. I would love to visit, visit that part of, of Europe. And uh, at some point, sooner than later, hopefully the war will end and we will be like... Uh, anyway. And uh, we have from Greece as well, Somewhere that I would love to visit to Greece. Uh, I want to visit Athens and the and the islands mainly, but you know Greece. You know it's it's the cradle of our civilization, right? So uh, thank you, Thomas and Mr. CLT. So if you're a member, it may say one month, but it'll post the correct month. Yes, apparently, apparently that's a when in Kansas City. Do do do. Let me think here. It's gonna be sometime in May. Sometime in May, I want to say early May, like week two of May, but uh, I, I, as soon as I get back to, to Florida, now that I'm a little, I'm work, working ahead on the videos a little bit, I'm, and I'm almost caught up, uh, I'm, I'm going to make a more micromanaged uh, trip. Hey, Steve, Loy, sorry, we're going to miss you in Savannah, man. Hi to you, your mom and Ely, sorry to miss you. Enjoy your trip and safe travel. See you soon. I'll see you soon for sure. We're going back to Savannah at some point. Very soon, actually. I think we're going to be back. So, yeah. Traveling rubber. I like the idea of dueling meetups. Should be fun. I might lead to record number for a meetup. Talking about dueling meetups. We have to do an Ohio, Michigan meetup. Uh, dueling meetups, right? I know you guys have that rivalry as well. Uh, what, what should we theme it? on like what theme should we use <laughs> um, anyway let me reset the chat here oh man this is uh, I'm losing my voice I'm just losing my voice what can I say it's uh, uh, I'm getting hungry I cannot but I just had some salmon and potatoes so yeah I could be hungry let me reset the chat here and uh, and go back up. Jay says, Juan Juan Huay Non. Arizona is amazing. One of our favorite places to go RVing. I agree. Arizona is amazing. It's probably one of the most underrated states. It's not all desert uh, for sure. <laughs> and I can I can vouch for that. And and uh, it's a great state. The same way that Kansas is not all uh, you know cornfields and prairies, although. 
most of it is, but there, there's, uh, there's also some things other than, than cornfields corn and prairies. And uh, what, what there is to see is very nice. And um, I can't wait to go back to like, like Topeka, uh, Kansas and, and places like that. <clears throat> SPC Red County EAS area. Yo, Robert, happy April Fools. Happy April Fools too, yeah. Um, Francisco Garces, saludos desde Venezuela. Mr. Robert, saludos a toda su audiencia. Gracias. Saludos a usted también. And um, looks sunny there. Yeah, it's sunny like a sunny delight. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look, look, at, look at the light right now. That light, that that you know, late afternoon light. It's beautiful out there. It's, a, it's, it's, it's turned out to be a beautiful day. It's been like raining on and off. Even when I was hiking the the the, the uh, you'll see it on the video. Actually, I did a Pelican Head update. If you're a member or a, or a patron, you'll be able to see it. It's, it's, it's out there already. But it was like one minute it was raining, like sprinkling and cold and cloudy. And the next minute the sun came out and it was like 10 degrees hotter. And uh, it, was, it was crazy. That, that's probably why I'm losing my voice. You know, it's, a, it's that change in temperature and weather and whatnot. Um. <clears throat> Uh, Brandon Sturgill, hello, hello, hope everyone is having a fantastic Friday evening, we are, cheers, cheers. You're funny, Robert, love it, oh, thank you. Um, snowing in Arizona today, Robert, no, don't tell me that, uh, well, it, it does snow in Arizona, especially at the high desert, and oh, the light right now, but I don't want to, I don't, I could close the window a little bit without... Oh, I, I got blinded by the sun. I can't read now. Just bear with me. Look at the look at the beautiful uh, uh, landscape there. Well, I say thank you, Johnny Kite Bartolo, for that super chat. Anyone visiting Fort Lauderdale? There's an awesome campground called Yet Haven, right on the river. Drove through this week, and it's a really cool spot with dog park, pools. Google it. Or oh, I should stay there. Since in Miami, I'm like what, 40, 40 minutes from, not even, half an hour from Fort Lauderdale. So, no, oh, it's Leap RV Repeat is here. Hello. You inspired us to go to Portland, made a year and a half ago. Yes, and I have to go back there too, by the way. Today would have been my grandma's 101th birthday today. Oh, happy birthday to your grandma, wherever she is. And uh, if you get a piece of property in Arizona from J57 tonight, tonight, would you go up to the mountains or down in the desert? Probably high desert, like the mountains, I'm thinking, Williams, Sholo, and uh, maybe somewhere like close to the California border, too. I love that the area, like maybe Kingman. So, uh, yeah. Uh, Sergio Jr. Hi, Robert. My wife and I love your YouTube videos, especially Yellowstone. Greetings from Brazil. Hello, Brazil. Uh, Alampar. Hi, hey, Robert. Debs' son is making arrangements for us to go to Las Vegas in late September. We are looking forward to... You ever been there? Uh, yeah, we've been to Las Vegas a couple of times, and we'll be back. It's a fun town, and I, and I love a fun town. Hey, G, photo girl. Hi, Robert. Where you at? We are at Natural Bridge, Virginia, at a beautiful RV resort here. As the sun starts going down, as the sun goes down over Santa Monica. Anyways, hello from Brazil. What is this place? Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's it's in the mountains in Virginia. Natural Bridge. There's a natural bridge. The whole area was owned by by Thomas Jefferson at some point. So yeah. I mean, it goes perfect with our uh, upcoming, uh, uh, you know, Lewis and Clark and Jefferson themed uh, trip. Uh, Joan Marie Gagnon, uh, thank you for that super chat. How have the gas prices been? Hope this helps. It's actually actually not been bad. I saw. Uh, I mean, all things are relative, right? Compared to to Texas in 2019, it's really bad. But compared to like other places. I just saw gas at a pilot on I-81 for like 380, 
which this day and age is really good. Uh, Gene Stark, okay, Robert, how come you don't go to any of the Florida Springs? My husband Scott and I would like to know. Uh, that's the best part of Florida inside the beaches. And uh, yeah, we're going to do some of those soon. And I keep meaning to do some of those. But it's one of those things, you know, that I don't know. I'm trying to do something here, but I don't want to. I don't want to make it that big. Hold on. No, it doesn't want to change the aspect ratio, so I can't do anything. Never mind. I, I, you know, some sometimes it goes uh, on top of my face, and uh, I bet New Mexico will be really inexpensive for land. Probably same price as, as uh, Arizona, more or less. So yeah. Cheers from Jerry and Colleen from Mount Dora, Florida. Lovely town, Mount Dora. I love it. Uh, Jerome Map, glad to be black back here for another of your live streams. Probably some of the most ent entertaining live streams out there. I'm glad you I'm glad you enjoy. I'm glad you find them entertaining. Thank you so much. Papago, Robert, they may still have the nights in the gardens and zoo lights at that time. Oh, Bishop, California, lovely town as well, especially what's around it. Are you going to be... And we're going west very soon here, in less than a month, um, throughout the northern um, part. Have you ever been to Kentucky? Yes, I've been several times. In fact, my, my cousin Juan... My good cousin Juan, he lives in Louisville, and uh, he might as well be a native Kentuckian now. He's been there his whole, his whole life. And uh, we've been there, we've been to, to Mammoth Cave many years ago. We haven't been to Kentucky lately, but we're going to change that, because as part of the Lewis and Clark trip, which at this point, Lewis and Clark, yeah, it's I'm very interested in the history. Don't, don't, mis don't, don't misinterpret what I'm going to say, but it's kind of... An, almost like an excuse to visit so many places along that route it's the just that it's so so we're gonna you know go over the ohio river of course falls of the ohio paducah the historical places but uh, we're also gonna do we might even go down to mammoth cave again who knows so um and uh, do a little bit of the bourbon trail and maybe the the the, the louisville slugger there in downtown louisville we'll see In one of your videos, you hit a pothole and swore in Cuban, and it made me laugh so hard. I thought it was what his car face again for the one thousandth time. <laughs> I'm, I'm new here. You must uh, love that movie yourself, Playa Pelican. I do, I do. That's the, and I, actually, I used to watch that movie like often because I had the VHS, then I had the DVD. I have the Blu-ray somewhere, uh, but uh, yeah, it's, it's one of those movies that that. Keeps on giving, you know. I watch it once in a while, and it, 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 it never gets old, you know. Like the beginning, you know. Why you call yourself Antonio Montana? And uh, and you, why do you call yourself? Uh, <laughs> anyway, anyway. Catherine Stargefield would love to meet up with you if you ever come to Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. Well, at some point, I want to do that, the, the, the Trans Canada Highway, and I do believe it goes through Edmonton. So. It's, it's, it's going to happen. I just don't know exactly when. It's, uh, it's a big world, but definitely I do want to revisit Canada and visit the parts of Canada that, that I haven't been to. I mean, I've been to Toronto ever so briefly, but I've seen Toronto. I've seen the, the Thousand Islands. I've seen Montreal. I've seen uh, Ottawa. And I've seen Quebec City. But like one day in each town. So it's that, that you know, I... I've seen it with my eyes, but I would love to enjoy uh, more of uh, the, the, the great uh, White North, uh, also known as Canada, that you have, you know, and, and, and of course, and I've been to Vancouver ever so briefly again, but, uh, hey, Upside Down Travels, uh, how are you? How are you, Alan? Uh, thank you for that super chat. Tell mom hi for me. Hi, mom. Alan says hi. Hi. She says hi, Alan. Uh, R. Crit, thank you for that super chat. 
Wiki Watch Springs is amazing too. Yes, it is. I've been there. I've been there. I did, did see the mermaids. I wanted to see the the, the normal show, but the, the, that day they were showing uh, the, the 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 you know a, a reenactment of the Little Mermaid, and it was very enjoyable. So um, it's it's amazing what they can do, and they've been doing that show like since the fifties. So if you like to try zip lining, there's. One in Cavern in, in Louisville, that's fun. Love your channel. You know, fun fact, I've never ziplined before. I've, I've, I've uh, sky, uh, sky dived once, but I haven't ziplined. So uh, that's on the list. Manny, are you coming to California? California love. Yes, most likely. Because... I don't know if I'm gonna make it all the way to Southern California, Manny, but I'm going to California. I'm going to for sure because I, I want to take I, uh, US 50 on the way back, and so the Western terminus is in Sacramento, your state capital. But uh, we'll see. We'll see uh, how we are doing with time. The, I, I know my mom wants to go to Southern California and visit her. her her friend there, my, my godmother actually, so uh, it is likely that we'll go to Southern California, but we'll see. Yvette Caraballo, our son, get married in Austin last weekend. We camped at the nice campground, Sunset RV Resort, well-maintained mom and pop place, so quiet at night, I was afraid to make any noise, slept well through, though, and uh, uh, that's great, that's great to know. You know, last time I stayed at that uh, Pecan Grove, I don't even know how I found out about that place. They don't even have a website. But it was good to, it was a little run down, but it was like in the middle of town. But good to know. And congratulations uh, to your son, Yvette and Jose. And, uh, and hope to see you soon in Texas. Neon Pony, thank you for that super chat. Thank you. And uh, Papago Park is north of Tempe, east of Phoenix. It's rather large and has many attractions, including old Hokoham ruins, botanical gardens, and more. We have to fit. We have to visit next time. Next time we visit, which is going to be in January. The, we're going back to Arizona in January if all goes well, you know. So um, Bob's videos. Thank you again for that super chat. Oh man. <clears throat> No military lounge for now. Thanks, moderator, and thanks, Robert, for the reply. I can narrate the movie Scarface beginning to end. Nobody likes watching it with me. They're lost. <laughs> okay, I'll shut up now. <laughs> I'm just going to say one thing. Just one thing. Say hello to my little friend. <laughs> oh, brother. Uh, greetings from Colorado Springs, uh, San Diego, California, one of your destinations in the future. I want to go back to San Diego and spend more time. Yes, absolutely. It seems like a, like a, like a great town, great fun town. So, yes. Thank you, Jeremy, for, for that super chat. Really like your cell phone boosters review video. Thank you so much. And, and uh, let me tell you, the only reason we're having a reliable connection today, well, maybe not the only reason, but it's been relatively reliable. It's uh, because, you know, that thing is it's really flooding this whole place with electromagnetic. Uh, actually, the, the, look where I have right here. By the way, that's temperature inside and outside. It's getting chilly outside, 49. Um, oh. It's a miracle it's working. I, I shouldn't be touching this. I didn't realize when the antenna uh, fell on the floor. But... Uh, that's the internal antenna right there, and that's my iPhone on uh, on visible, which uses Verizon antennas. So there you go. Now watch it. I, I, I fix the antenna, and it dies. <laughs> Wouldn't that be ironic? Ty Zemke. Just found your channel this week. Really enjoying it from Wisconsin. Huh? Welcome, welcome to the welcome to the community here to our to our place uh, uh, every Friday. Every Friday, six p.m. We hang out, and uh, you know, I get to talk to you, and uh, it's 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 always fun. Saudi Arabia, 
Yahia Al Musa, thank you. So I like your videos. Thank you so much for being here, all the way from Saudi Arabia. We we really, we really do run an international show, don't we? Uh, love that map, Robert. Uh, thank you so much, Freddy Dust, and the map. I'm, you know, I'm gonna update it soon. And I have a real little mess up here with all my GoPros and all that. Did you forget my super chat? I don't know. I didn't see a super chat, but if you did, thank you, William Brody, Brody, for that super chat. I don't know. You know, it's it's uh, sometimes it's it's hard. So I apologize if if I miss a super chat. And uh, are you planning to fly the drone this evening? Not after this. I shouldn't. I already got some great show shots here of the park. I asked permission. They normally don't allow drones in this park, but since I'm doing a video for them, in in a sense. Uh, uh, you know, they and, and I and I did it like two days ago. There was no one here, so um, someone's asking uh, what kind of microphone is behind you. This is actually a very old mic. This is a I don't think they make it anymore, but this is the first mic that I bought when I when I started my recording studio back in two thousand, and it's a Audio Technica AT three five two five. It's a large diaphragm. Uh, cardioid um, condenser mic I like the way it sounds I've had it for so many years you know I have other mics that I could use but for my voiceovers on the podcast that's what I use let's take a peek outside here real quick yeah it doesn't look uh, all that much different but as you can see you know the sun is off the mountain now the sun is slowly but surely going down and uh, Thank you, 477 of you watching right now. Thank you so much. Hey, Carl, how are your neighbor? William Rizari. Comment. That's why I always greet. Greet. What? <laughs> uh, Mary Gates, you're a celebrity around here. My grandkids know you. Love your... Um, Love your channel, beautiful scenery and information. Thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate it. Make sure that all the details appear, especially the cooking inside the caravan and the method of operating its devices. Sometimes I do, sometimes uh, I, I, you know, my, well, the, the, the way that I do it most of the time is just more focused on the travel, but sometimes, you know, I, I'll show the things that I'm doing here and there. So well, now that we know that this camera is working correctly, uh, uh, Michelle K, congratulations on being on the cover of RV Magazine. Now you're a centerfold. Oh, gosh. <laughs> no, they did a great interview and I appreciate it. And uh, check them out. I mean, they've been doing, I mean, I'm in good company. They've been doing a, a, a YouTube celebrity pretty much. Am I a celebrity? As YouTube, you know, YouTuber every month, like um, no, I just saw, I just saw my the 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 bandwidth line here go down, and I got nervous for a second. They did like KYD. They've done Let's Jump More Journey. They've done uh, RV Miles. You know, everybody uh, pretty much. So I'm in good company being in that uh, centerfold, as you as you call it. Uh, CLT, so Robert, are you going to do a cooking show with Mama Alma? We already did, and you're going to have to wait uh, a few days, about a month, to see it, actually, because uh, we did it today, actually, we cooked some picadillo together. No, yesterday. It was yesterday. This is the thing, we were doing laundry and, and the picadillo at the same time, so at one point I had to go make the laundry, and she, you know, I left her in charge of, of the RV, and uh, yeah. Our crits, uh, Robert, please say hi to my love stricken mother. Her name is Barbara. I just told her you're married already. <laughs> hi, Barbara. Gigi, Lord Robert, we love your videos. Skipping around. Hey, from Sebring, Florida. When when are you starting your Lewis and Clark uh, um, adventure? Uh, in less than a month. I want to say three weeks as soon as soon as 
Minitini one is complete, like repaired, fully repaired. Uh, that's what we're doing. Yeah. So where were we? Our Wally Burris, thank you for the super chat pair character. Oh, that's a super sticker. Let me see what it looks. Oh. Thank you for that. Ooh, oh, but my voice is gone. I can't talk anymore. I'm gonna just have to type. In Spanish, you would say "se me fue un gallo," but you know, that there's there's no translation for that. So, any updates on Minitini? It's getting it it, it it turned out it is prohibitively expensive to replace the axles, so we're just gonna align them as best as possible. And we're gonna, you know, do like a whole, you know, the whole bearings, brakes, you know, make it almost like new, new tires too. And then we found found out that there's a couple, the roof is not in good shape, so we're gonna do the roof as well. Uh, Deborah Gomez, love when you walk the trails. It's always beautiful. Well, I did two trails today, so that's gonna be that was, that's gonna be a good. Uh, uh, it's California Gold Country. On your itinerary, if you have an extra half a day, Calaveras Big Trees is a great place to see giant sequoias. Gold Country is definitely if, if we may if we make it all the way, you know, it's uh, we're gonna do the the West Sierra this time, you know, like Gold Country. So we're definitely gonna do that. <clears throat> mm -hmm. I'm losing my voice. I don't know what's going on. Mark Jones, hey Robert, can you please say happy retirement to Mark as he retired yesterday. Camping we go. Hey, well, congratulations, Mark. Happy retirement. Yes. El Gallito is due to low levels of IPA consumption. I agree. I agree. You have to convince my mom to, to, to let me have another one. Uh, how many states have you been to, Robert? All lower 48 and Alaska. So uh, how, at this point, Hawaii is the only one uh, missing, really. Ask Remy. What did I miss? Oh, you missed the best part. You know, I was dancing on... No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Honey, ginger, cinnamon, make a tea. It should help your throat. Yeah, I know either that or... Yeah, probably. Look so amazing where you are. I'm jealous. Yeah, it's a, it's a pretty place. It's a, look, look, at the, look at the sun coming down uh, and uh, over that mountain there. And that, that tree. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not a bad shot, is it? Um, Arkritz, thank you for that super chat. Thank you, Robert. You made my mother's night. Adventurous Jerry Lynn got a kick out of your high Barbara also. Cool. Thank you. Favorite camping spots, hidden gems in rural Florida. Oh, man, Suwannee River State Park. Uh, some of those, you know, like in northern Florida state parks. And um, But that's not a hidden gem. Hidden Gem is Pelicamp. That's you know the property that I bought, but uh, I'm not sharing. Uh, maybe I'm, I'll be sharing in the future. But uh, Traveler Robert, I understand that you are not planning an Oregon meetup in June. I may, I may, I may do an Oregon meetup in June. Let's do Portland, Portland sometime in June. Yeah, as as soon as I have that. And that and I'm probably going to release it on the newsletter, so make sure that you're subscribed to the newsletter. But um, I'm, I'm going to, in a couple of weeks, I'm going to know for sure, more or less, where I'm going to be, you know, give or take a week. Uh, but I would love to do a, a, like a Portland meetup or a, or a band meetup, you know, one of the two. Robert, Robert, then Jamestown and Coloma is a must-see. Next time, next time. We're not going to do Jamestown this time around. But uh, uh, Rafael Munoz, when are you going to Hawaii? Uh, I don't know, in a couple of years. In a couple of years, uh, we'll, we'll make it there for sure. 
Uh, Hawaii is a very long drive. You know, I'm waiting. I'm waiting for the, the for the bridge or the tunnel or you know, right? Wouldn't that be nice to have a, a bridge and a tunnel that went to Hawaii? <clears throat> You're probably suffering from allergies. You know, it, it, at the beginning I, saw, I thought it was allergies, but it's 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 been going on for a while, so I'm starting to get like... Um, uh, my daily agenda, traveling Robert. Hi, Robert, love your videos. Can I ask what kind of drone you use? Right now I have the DJI Mavic 2 Zoom, and I like it. I like it. It's good. Oh, no, but I got to do it. Thank you for that, Anthony Bridges. <laughs> Thank you for that. Super chat. Maybe if I do falsetto, it'll be better. Uh, not necessarily on this one. Save your voice for your videos. Thank you so much. And, and you will notice, like in the Naples video and the previous one, when I'm doing the, the voiceover, it's uh, it's not the, the, the same voice. I, I'm, I'm kind of uh, struggling there a little bit. Thumbs up confirmed. And you guys can't see it, but we actually have two of these likes. I don't know why. Uh, hi, Robert. Love the vids. Jones Gap State Park and the Chiro Cherokee Foothills here in South Carolina are great for hiking and waterfalls. I think, and, and you know, we, we're kind of heading south quickly after after Saturday. You know, we have four nights here. So tomorrow we're going to do Monticello and then we're kind of making a beeline for Charleston. Uh, I want to do a quick video on Charleston. And we're going to make a quick stop in Savannah and then... By next uh, Thursday or Friday, we should be back at home base. Hey, Charlie Grace, happy Friday. Any live driving? Miss those. Oh, maybe. Maybe we'll do one of those tomorrow. I haven't done those, I think, since like North, North Dakota, really. So, yeah. How long until you start leasing spots at Pelly Camp? Not, not in time soon. I mean, that, that was never the plan. Uh, I might we, we might have you know occasional guests, but where do I sign up for the newsletter? That would be at travelingrobert.com. Join the mailing list, and I just sent one this morning. And I kind of like the plan is to, I'm gonna really try to send one every first of the month. So, who's doing the repairs in Minitini? It's a reputable shop. Uh, north of Jacksonville seems seems reputable. Our friend uh, Casita RV Life uh, recommended it, and uh, they, they seem to do a good job. So I'm very happy. So yeah, Casita RV Life, there you go. Jim April Fools, what? You developed a rooster in your throat. There you go. That's William Irisari. That would be like the 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 the, the real translation of my. Of my uh, ailment. <laughs> Cheers. We're running out. Mark Z Hammer. Thank you for the super chat. Traveling Robert and Alma Morales. Keep on rolling down the road. Cheers. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Mark. Keep on, keep on rolling in the free world, man. And. Uh, Who were uh, you develop a rooster in your throat? Yeah, I already read that one. Uh, Sunny seventy four. Hello, Robert and Chad. Hello there. And uh, let let's see what it looks like outside because I kind of closed my window so I wouldn't get the sun in my smoke gets in your eyes. Look at that! Look at the beautiful, beautiful colors this time of the evening. The 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 the, the sky is almost completely clear now. Very few clouds in the sky. And uh, question: Do you know the song "Who Let the Dogs Out"? Ah, oh, Dylan, you're you're talking about "Who Let the Dogs Out"? Who? I don't have the voice for that right now. <laughs> James Stone Ministries, love all your videos. Thank you, Lisa De Laurentiis, my my husband just met you in La Mesa in Fort Pierce. Oh yes, I remember. Of course, yes, uh, yes, he was uh, getting some some service on the. On the interstate, on the on the um, Erstrom interstate. Uh, with, I'm glad you and your mom had a good trip. Yes, we're having a good trip. We're like kind of halfway through the trip at this point. 
so we're starting to head back very soon. Maybe you need a mojito. You know what would cure this immediately, but there are no liquor stores around here. Uh, uh, Johnny Walker on the, rock, on the rocks. But uh, Mr. Ask Remy, uh, Robert, I want you to. I want to use your music on my business phone line. So when they wait, it plays your music instead of what we have now. Yeah, go for it. Make make sure Desert Rain is on that one, right? Beautiful, beautiful sunset where you are. Yes, it is. Beautiful scene. Thank you, Ramin Passion, as well as Giggles Pickles. Uh, do you think life is all about money? No, it's not. Life is about experiences. And uh, that's pretty much it. That's the only thing that if there's something else, that's the only thing you're going to take. Your experiences, whatever you learned, whatever you saw, whatever you felt. And, uh, and money just helps, you know, with the... With the you know, being able to realize things, but uh, it's it's not all life is about, that's for sure. Uh, hi, Robert. Was unsubscribed on my YouTube channel. You was unsubscribed on my YouTube channel. I'm sorry. Resubscribe and click the bell and smash that like button, like they say. Uh, Gold Country Visit could include a stop at Auburn. We have a four world class breweries here. Oh, breweries! Now you're talking my language. Oops. And the beer is gone. And the tallest bridge in California at the convergence of North and Middle Forks of the American River. We should go. I definitely want to visit a Gold Country and uh, the Lost RVers. What's his name? He always tells me that uh, that I mean we we, we get to, to chat a lot during the the Q21 meetup in in, uh, in Quartzsite and Gold Country he says it's it's, uh, it's a must see in uh, in California so are you taking Minitini 1 on your Lewis and Clark trip uh, Robin Minkler? no I'm taking Minitini 3 Minitini 1 I'm thinking I'm thinking Alaska, maybe, and Baja. You know, maybe, maybe make it a little off-road capable and uh, and go to those, do some of those. But we'll see. Hey, a fine shot of bourbon would do it too. Some Maker's Marks right here. But I don't have any. Yosemite is the best. I, Yosemite is definitely top five. Uh, I think you should try out Missouri. Missouri is beautiful. I've been to the to the riverways, to the National Ozark Riverways in southern Missouri, and uh, and uh, yeah. I'm new. Love your show. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for being new. Thank you for 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 being here. Uh, have you tried drinking Pel Pils Pilsen? I've, I've tried some Czech beers that could qualify as that, and I like them. There's no button on the website to sign up for the newsletter. The text is there, but no button. Really? I'm gonna have to talk to Remy. I'm, I'm, let me see. Let me see. Let me let me look at it myself and uh, see if we can figure this one out. If you scroll down to the bottom, there's a submit button. Okay, let me show you. Let me see if I can show you this. Yes. Here we are. That's travelingrobert.com right there. You go down. That's... By the way, check out the, the magazine. The, the the camping magazine. The RV camping magazine. And then you keep going down. There's videos. And then you can listen to my music. And then right at the bottom there, subscribe to our mailing list. You put your name, your email, and click submit. And uh, yeah, that's how you do it. This is how you do it. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Didn't you have to do your like like a phone number before? No, that no, that that's that's to send me that's to send me a an email. But to subscribe to the to the mailing list, that's all you need to do. Name. An email, and uh, I promise I won't spam you. I spam you. It will just be, it will just be like a like a monthly email or 
or as soon as I have like the itinerary for the summer, I'll I'll put it there too. I'll put it out there too. Oh, we're being it's seven oh eight already. Wait, man, it's, it is true what they say: time flies when they have when you're having fun. Uh, William Brody, Brody, thank you for that super chat. Desert rain plays in my head all day at work. Desert rain, wipe away the. Uh, I enjoy your voice. Uh, what's le what's left of it? <laughs> By looking good on the Army magazine, life is good. Yeah, it's uh, um, you know they, they they send me the interview questions and uh, they ask me to send them some pictures and that's pretty much what I did. And uh, yeah, hello, Marisha Hanish. Uh, wow, traveling Robert can't even do a convincing Montel Williams. Hey, what do you know? <laughs> about the i-75 challenge i mentioned a couple of fridays ago you can only go off the highway just to check out stuff overnight and see family because i-75 goes through atlanta i-75 challenge yeah I, I, um, yeah happy friday robert uh, thank you logistics guy we enjoy watching you with my uncle carl it's his birthday. Can you give him a shout out? Happy birthday, Uncle Carl. Happy birthday to you. Hot tea, whiskey, lemon, honey, good for your throat. How about one margarita, two margarita, three margarita shots? <clears throat> All right, everybody. I'm going to start uh, wrapping this up. We've been at it for uh, a little over an hour now. What does it say? One hour, 16 minutes and 40 seconds. So, um, I'm always singing free in my RV and I don't have an RV. Well, thank you. Uh, I like your hat. Beautiful. Thank you. This, this is the free in my RV hat. And I also have a hat with this Pelican logo that says Pelican head. And I'm going to do a bunch of, I'm, I'm going to revamp the store a little bit whenever I have the time. And uh, maybe retire some of the old. Uh... There you go. The lost our viewers are here. I was just talking about you and and what you recommended in Gold Country. So hey, Robert, uh, Sutter's Creek, Auburn, Jackson, but uh, Allegheny, Casey Bar, eighteen eighty six will blow your mind. A non trailer towing outline uh, outing for sure. Back country. I'm gonna give you a call whenever we are in the area so we can hang out together uh, over there. Hey, Bill in Utah. You, yeah, you have to put that in practice. Bill and Livy. Livy. Thank you all for being here. It trails on waves. Hello there. And uh, enjoy Monticello. Thank you. Robert is tired. Hello. Well, I, I did a, a couple of hikes today. And it's been a long, uh, not a long trip, but um, we've done a lot. We've done a lot. We've walked a lot. And... Uh, Certainly driven a lot. Uh, Mitchell Karachior, thank you for the super chat. Homer, Alaska, 40-ish, rain, four feet of snow. Thank you for that super chat. And uh, Homer, Alaska, not this time of the year. That's uh, Nate and Marisa, you know. The, uh, I, I do want to go to Alaska in, in winter, though. I do want to go to Alaska in winter. I've always, you know, ever since I went to Alaska in 2010... And we stayed at uh, at the Arctic Getaway up there in, in what's the name of that town? Uh, what's the name of the town just north of Coldfoot? Wiseman, Wiseman, Alaska. Uh, I said one one of these days I'm gonna come here and spend a couple of days in winter just to to to, to experience the solitude of the of the midnight. The midday night. How do you call that when it doesn't, you know, when the sun doesn't come out for for days on end, and uh, and experience that. Daniel Ruiz, thank you for that super chat. Daniel Ruiz, we love Sutter Creek. Uh, we have to go up there. And Kimberly Fishbach, thank you for that super sticker. Thank you. That's it. That's it. We're gonna wrap it up. Thank you everybody for coming. Uh, we still have about. Uh, what, 445 of you watching at this mo at this moment? Oh, 
All right, let's see if I can sing. Let's see if I can sing. Ah. And let's see uh, what it looks like out there, you know. It's getting dark. You know, it's almost the end of the day. Let me see. What's wrong with this? Okay, here we go. <laughs> All right, everybody, here we go. I'm writing, <clears throat> I'm writing, writing in my RV, wherever I want to be. Because I'm free in my RV, yeah, I'm writing. Riding in my RV, wherever I want to be, yeah, yeah, cause I'm free in my RV, yeah, riding. <laughs> Good night, everybody. Have a great Friday. Have a great weekend. Enjoy the weekend. And um, I'll see you next Friday. Same channel, different state. Actually, probably from Florida. See you on the road.